Hey there folks, John here with Through My Lens, and today I'm coming to you with another photography related video. Today I'm going to be talking to you about watch photography, which as fans of Through My Lens know is a subject that's very near and dear to my heart. I've been doing watch photography for over 20 years. I used to do it professionally, uh, and I used to do a lot of freelance writing and photography for most of the luxury wristwatch trade publications uh, you know, in the 2000 to 2010 time frame. Uh, I eventually started my own online watch enthusiast community called Watch Talk Forums, which uh, I sold in 2012. Now at that time, I was pretty burnt out. I was working day and night uh, you know, in the watch industry and I just needed a break. Uh, so I sold my community and I really didn't do a lot with watches for the next 10 years. But in 2022, I kind of reignited that passion and I bought a couple of watches this year and I've been doing more watch photography. Uh, I've bought some uh, new gear and equipment this year and I'm definitely going to do some future videos on that. But I've also been on the hunt for online resources to help me improve uh, my watch photography. And one of the resources that I found that's been very helpful in that uh, particular niche uh, area of, of knowledge is an Instagram account called Watch Studies. Now, there's just not a lot of information out there on how to do watch photography. There, you'll find a lot of Instagram uh, content, a lot of YouTube content on product photography, on uh, macro photography, but not a lot geared specifically toward watches in particular. And there are a lot of unique challenges when taking a photograph of a watch that you really need uh, someone with some experience to help guide you along the way. And Watch Studies uh, is an account, again, on Instagram that not only produces some just fantastic daily watch photography content, watch videos, uh, but also does a lot of behind the scenes type content, a lot of uh, training and tutorial content geared toward helping you really elevate your uh, capabilities in watch photography, which I greatly appreciate. Uh, he also has a website, and I'll link to both the Instagram account and the website in the description box in this video. Uh, he also has some uh, subscriber-based content. I recently subscribed, I think it's only $3 a month. Uh, it's well worth it. Uh, he does some, uh, some articles and some content geared toward things like how to do better wrist shots. Uh, do you know what a parrot shot is? I didn't before I started really following watch studies, and I can tell you that uh, you know, the parrot shot is a phenomenal take on the classic uh, wrist shot. Uh, he also tells you to do things like, you know, how to pose your hands, something I never really thought a whole lot before. Um, you know, he talks a whole lot about, you know, lighting, uh, props, uh, you know, some gear conversation. Uh, it's really just an invaluable resource, again, if you want to improve your watch photography game. Um, Again, links in the description box in this video. Uh, highly recommend you take a look at watch studies. Uh, again, I'll be producing some videos uh, in the near future talking about some of the new uh, gear and the new techniques that I'm using to improve my watch photography. So definitely do follow and consider subscribing to watch studies. Uh, again, links in the description box of this video to his Instagram account and website. And also remember that in addition to the uh, Through My Lens YouTube channel here, I do have a Through My Lens JBH Instagram account. I encourage you to follow that for my daily uh, photography content. Uh, you'll be seeing a lot of watch photography there as well as you know, all kinds of different photography. Well, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Take care. God bless. I'll see you in the next one. I hope you've enjoyed this production from the Through My Lens YouTube channel. If you did, please click on the like button and do share the video on social media. If you'd like to see more content like it, please do subscribe to the channel, follow me on Instagram and Facebook, and do check out Through My Lens at www.throughmylens.org.